Hi friends, this is our sea level reader this week, and this week I'm doing all of these stories um, with characters like this, and I've heard you guys really like these ones with this type of art, um, and they're all illustrated by Mark Weber, so you'll see if you watch any of the other videos that they're all illustrated by him. So this story is called My Baby Brother, and we're going to see uh, some sight words in here. And we're going to see some special words like brother and baby that we'll need to kind of start to memorize because we're going to see them a lot in this book. So first, let's start with some sight words that we're going to see. These are ones that you guys are pretty used to. So go ahead and say it when you see it. Yeah, me. What's the next one? He. Nice job. Do. Can, at, my, and said. All right, so these are all words we're going to see in this story. Uh, there's also some words that we can sound out that we're going to see in this story. For example, we might see the word, what's that sound? Mmm, good. What's this sound? Ah. N -a -t not. Good job. Another word we might see that we need to sound out is b a t b a t but. Now the but isn't like our butt butt. Uh, it's not our behind. It's but like, oh, I want to go to the store or I want to go outside and go for a walk, but it's raining. It's that type of butt. All right, and then another one we might sound out is this one. What sound is that? Mm, uh, ch. Mm, uh, ch. Remember, the CH is a digraph, so it's one new sound, right? The C, you don't hear the C or the H, it's a whole new sound. It's the sound ch. Much. Much. All right, so those are the words we're going to sound out in our story. There's some words that are kind of tricky, so we're not going to sound them out. I'm, we're going to practice them before we start. So one is, who is this? Yeah, that's the baby brother. So we have the word baby. Okay, that's the word baby. And then we're going to see the word brother as well. Baby brother. Now, if this is his baby brother, then who is this? Yeah, the older brother. Okay. Well, let's do a little picture walk. So this is the big brother and this is the baby brother. And it says, da -da 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 -da, said Victor. So what is the big brother's name? Yeah, Victor. So we got to remember that too. Victor. Okay, and the capital V means it's his name. So we're going to see these words throughout the story. Now, the words that we're going to look for for um, using our picture clues, right? Using our picture power with our sound power are the words that are going to change on every page, right? Now, I'm going to tell you it's going to be what the baby brother can do. So Victor's telling the story, and he's telling us, my baby brother can do this or can't do this or can do this. And so we're going to have to pay attention to what his baby brother is doing in each picture. All right, let's read our story, friends. My baby brother. My baby brother. All right, you try to read first. Look at the picture. And then look at here. My brother is a baby, said Victor. He cannot do much. Mm. Yeah, when you're a baby, you're still learning how to do everything. All right, what do you think Victor's talking about here? Hmm. Ooh, I see a key word right here. My baby brother cannot walk 
said Victor. So you see how he's doing a walk shape? And we know that because the baby brother's not doing it, he's saying that he cannot do it. But Victor can, because he's the big brother. <laughs> he looks annoyed. He's eating a walkie-talkie. <laughs> he cannot talk, said Victor. He can't walk, he can't talk. Whoa. He cannot jump, said Victor. What's happening here? He looks worried. He cannot play ball, said Victor. See the ball? Mm. He cannot play games, said Victor. He cannot read, said Victor. Oh, but he can smile at me, said Victor. Yay! And look, he even has his first tooth coming in. <laughs> and I bet Victor's going to teach him how to do all those things as he grows and is able to move his body and start talking too. That was a fun story. Thanks for reading that with me, friends. And I hope you enjoyed our C book today.